All right, guys, it's your boy, New Teddy Era, and today I'm coming at you with a real quick deck profile of my Stella Knights. Right now, my tripod broke, so uh, I did purchase this one there. Right there, I'm just waiting for the attachment to come in. Once that comes in, I'll be able to do my videos again. But uh, we're going to be doing a deck profile of my Stella Knights. Sorry for all my mess. I've been testing and building decks and things for I could put up for you guys so we're gonna get right into it first of course we run triple Deneb um, this deck did get a little handed with Rhoda going to one but still we have Deneb that gets you everything so yeah then we have triple Altier everybody knows what this does this deck is very self-explanatory three a Yukao line um, or ukulele, I call her. Um, I bumped this up to three. It was at two in my previous build, but this is now at three because Rhoda going to one, um, you had to run a little more names. So double Vega and one All Sham. I'll tell you why I'm running All Sham is because I'm running Skybridge. So with um, Skybridge lets you get other plays with Stellar Knight monsters. So I figured the best bet is to run an All Sham. To give me more options of certain cards that I need to to use to better the game state and help me win against my opponent. Alright. No Thunder King. It is in a side deck, but I don't usually show side deck because that's all players' preference. But Thunder King would be a card that will be needed in the side deck. Three upstarts, of course. Two instant fusions. Because um Noted in this deck is really good. Um, the one sky bridge, I might bump this up to two, but right now at one is running perfectly fine. One Rota, one Book of Moon, one main deck MST. The reason I main deck this, because some people are running main decks out like mistakes. Um, uh, a lot of little things, macro, DeFi. So a main deck MST to help out. And of course you aside the other two. Regeki. And Soul Charge. Okay, on to the traps. It's a real hefty trap lineup. So, here it goes. Three Nova Alphas. Triple Mirror Force. Now that um, Shadals are out the way, um, this is really good because with Shadals, yeah, they could get their fusions back. But it doesn't really matter because after they run out of options, they really can't do anything. So... That was the only reason why I felt um, Dimension Prison was better than Mirror Force. But now that they're gone, Mirror Force is better for me. Three Fiendish Chains. Um, it would be breakthroughs, but in this deck, you can recycle so much continuous traps. Call of the Hornets and Fiendishes, so you reuse them. And speaking of Call of the Hornet, three Call of the Hornets. One Torrental, one Bottomless, one Warning. And last but not least, Vanity's Emptiness. Um, by the way, my extra deck is not complete. I just spent some money and got um, Talamias or Palamias, the other guy. Um, but this is what I have. One Diamond. Double Delteros. One of them will be coming out for that Talamias or whatever his name is. Double Trevier. One Omega. One Eighty Six. One Blade Armor Ninja. Double Castell, one on one because Exiton is no longer a thing, so I had to replace it with something. Dweller, Conar Gorgon, and Double Noden. So that's the deck profile, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. Um, if you have any questions for me, you're more than welcome to write in the comments section. And it's your boy New Teddy Era out. All right, guys, peace.